at night, I sit at my window and regard the stars. Sometimes, sometimes I think they're my stars. I think, I think I shall be a star someday. Yes, yes, yes. I can name them all. Venus, Mars, Neptune, Gloria Swanson. <laughs> I don't take much stock in astronomy. I've been thinking of the London lady and calling to mind my daughter gone down for to be a typewriter. I liked also Mr. Ricky. She was so plump, so round, so buxom. <laughs> Not worth the paper she was padded with. <laughs> uh, how's your asthma, Mr. Ricky? Ah, uh, worse, thank God. I'm a hundred years old. I'm getting pretty old. Well, I suppose life's been pretty tame ever since he gave up petty arson. <laughs> Hmm. Yes, yes. Uh, the, the thing is, Peter, you see, when I was 50, I reformed once. In prison. You went wrong again? Uh, worse than that. The week before uh, my term was to expire, they transferred to me the glands of a young prisoner who they were executing. And that renovated you. <laughs> renovated me. Put the old nick right back in me. <laughs> Turned out the young rascal was not only a suburban burglar, he was also a kleptomaniac. <sighs> What's a little playful arson in comparison? How oh, ghastly. Science is the bunk. Yeah, well, I think I have him tamed now. You know, it isn't everyone has to tire out two sets of glands in his lifetime. <laughs> I wouldn't have another set for all of the animal spirits in an orphan asylum. <laughs> well, I shouldn't think you'd object to a nice old clergyman set. Clergymen do not have plans. <laughs> <laughs> they have souls. Bylaws. 
At Eton, I was a member at Pop. At Rugby, I belonged to Near Beer. As a younger son, I was destined for the police force. Oh, skip that. Mm -hmm. Have you money? <laughs> <laughs> What's of it? I shall expect also to go downtown each morning in sections. In two Rolls Royces. I also have a kitty car and a converted tank. I have seats at the opera. Oh, but I can't sleep but in a box. And I heard that you were cashiered from your club. A cashier? I was cashiered. What for? I hit the polo balls one day for a joke. Is your mind in good shape? Fair. <laughs> After all, what is brilliance? Merely the tap to sew when no one is looking and reap when everyone is. Be careful. I will not let my daughter marry an epigram. I assure you I'm a mere platitude. I often descend to the level of an innate idea. None of what you say matters. I cannot marry a man who says it would be Jack. Why, Frank would just not say this. You're a fool! Tut, tut, tut. You must not judge. Charity, <coughs> my girl. Remember what Nero said? With malice for none, with charity toward all. Oh, that wasn't Nero. That was John Drinkwater. Uh, come now, who's this Jack? <laughs> who's this Frank? God, don't see. We were arguing that if they were deadly enemies and locked in a room together, which one would come out alive? Now I claim that Jack would take one look. Wrong! He wouldn't have a chance in hell again. You win! Then I love you again. <laughs> I'm going to lose my little daughter. Oh, you've still got a house full of children. <laughs> I'm going to see. I'm going to see. <laughs> you went to see a long time ago. <laughs> I've been reading Conrad. Conrad, two years before the pass by Henry James. What? Walter Painter's version of Robinson Crusoe. I can't stay here in Rockies. I want to live my life. I want to hunt eels. I'll be here when you come back. My worms are licking their chops already when they hear your name. Oh. Fails, these hills, these McCormick harvesters, they mean nothing to my children. I understand. Then you'll think of me kindly, Father. To understand is to forget. Oh, no, no, no. We never forgive those we understand. We only forgive those who wound us for no reason. Oh, I'm so beastly sick of your human nature. And anyway, I hate the hours around here. I'm going away. I'm leaving you. They're all deserting me. It's my own fault. I've been too kind. <laughs> Spare the rod and spoil the fun. <laughs> oh, for the glands of a Bismarck. <laughs> <laughs> to the great potato tradition. <laughs> <laughs> oh, words worth, words worth, we spoke so true. No motion has she now, no force. She cannot see or feel, roll round in her diurnal course in someone's oldsmobile.
<laughs> I must be quaint. That's all there is. Life doesn't count. It's the quaintness you bring to it. We're going to slide down the Riviera. We've got tickets to the Piccadilly Circus. Life! 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 Jazz! 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 Jazz. <laughs> Wait. Let me read to you from the Bible. <laughs> I'll pick a passage at random. You can always find something that suits the situation. Ahab and Istimo and Anim, Gosan and Olam and Gilo, eleven cities and their villages, Arab and Ruma and Esau. Buy ten more rings and try again. How beautiful art thou, my love, how beautiful art thou, thy eyes of dove's eyes besides what is hid within. Thy hair is as flocks of goats which come up from Mount Galilee. <laughs> <laughs> Another course passage. <laughs> jack, 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 jack. Oh, life is primarily suggestive. <laughs> Won't work today. It must be damp. Yes, it's damp. There must be water in the dog. It won't work. It's damp. It won't work. Jazz! 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 Come, we want to catch the 